and welcome back to the workshop um, uh, late to the party as usual but I'm going to have a quick crack at the donut challenge uh, issued by Gord Rock um, I think it closes on the 31st of May so there's no way I'll be finished by then but uh, I thought it was uh, a good idea once again I'm keeping on the uh, the idea of using stuff that's already in the workshop rather than hacking up uh, new bits of wood so I found some bits of offcuts um, I'm going to make a plate out of MDF it's not good stuff to turn MDF really but it's the only thing I've got big enough without chucking up without uh, chopping up a huge great big lump of something or other so I'll see how that goes uh, I'm also going to make uh, obviously the donut itself which is the whole idea and I shall also uh, do a, a cup which will look uh, supposedly like a, a coffee cup uh, we'll see how it goes I'll just give you a quick uh, flash of what's on the lathe at the moment it's a piece of MDF which I've got marked up um, and we'll crack on and start turning that machining anything MDF that you use a uh, face mask respirator or that sort of thing because it can be uh, quite carcinogenic MDF and we've got enough things uh, wandering around at the moment without uh, making it worse Turn it round, put it back on the face plate, and I'll just do a little bit of digging out and see what the score is.
okay well that's the first coat of sealer on there I'll put another coat on shortly and see about uh, making the donut I suppose let's have a look see what we've got for that all right make a start on the old donut I suppose clean this bit off get it ready all rubbed down to 240. I'm just going to give it a quick coat of light oak stain because I wanted a sort of a, a baked sort of look rather than a browny burnt sort of look. That doesn't look very uh, light oak. As the more observant amongst you might realise, that's only half a donut. I'm not sure whether it's the dough or whether it's the nut. But uh, I am going to find another bit of wood to make the top half. Right, I've put a couple of screws just through there. That's MDF, it's going to get painted or whatever, so I'll just fill those two holes. I'm going to put it in there so I can take out the actual plate from the frame that it's in. Hopefully. glued a little bit of uh, Maranti on the top there which is going to be the top part of the donut representing chocolate or whatever and I get some shape in it and see what happens
okay well the final part of this is going to be a mug because you can't have a uh, chocolate top donut without a mug of coffee can you so I've got a uh, piece of Leylandi and I'm just going to roughly turn a mug shape and I have to cut a handle out Okay, well, I've got it flipped round in the old uh, chuck now. Just round that off. Put a little bit of shape on the top and dig out uh, for the coffee. <laughs> That's all sanded down to 240. I'm going to get a couple of coats of the sanding sealer. And then stick some uh, finish on it. Not quite sure what yet. I might go for a slightly darker finish. It's quite a light wood. But it matters too much. Right, I'll put a bit of wood wax 22 on it for a uh, see what it looks like. I say it's not particularly good wood. So we shall see. One mug. Mark that up, get rid of the polish, stick that on. Marvellous. Now all we've got to do, get the tenon off the back and put some coffee in it. <laughs> <laughs> 